Hello, friends and family, business owners. Um, I Tonight, I'm going to share how to create a digital photo book. And actually, I've never created a digital photo book. It's going to be my first time. But um, in the digital playground that I use, it's called Canva. I noticed that it's a new feature. And I haven't noticed it before. Maybe it's been there for a while. And I just, I just didn't notice it. So I thought, well, why not give it a try? So that's what I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to demo um, how to do a digital photo book. And I don't know about any of you, if you want to share with me in the comments, if any of you have done um, scrapbooking before, but that's what this reminds me of is scrapbooking, except that you don't have to have all the supplies. And, you know, if you've done scrapbooking, then you know what I'm talking about with all the different colors of paper and stickers and all the things. <clears throat> so when you log into Canva, this is where you'll land. This is a home screen. And here's where I noticed it says new right here in this little red part, photo book. So I thought, well, let's see if we, um, how to play in here. All right. So you can see here um, on the panel on the left, there's different templates for you to use. So they have travel, Mother's Day, holiday, all results. And next to each one, it's not just these two. There's a button here that, that says see all. So if you click the see all button, you can see all the options. So I'm actually going to look at the travel photo book. I want to see all the options. So you can see here, it's kind of small, but if you click on one, then it'll populate here and then you can look at it bigger. You can change your mind, of course. So if you just kind of scroll down here and you can see, it looks like a lot of them have uh, 22 images in the photo book. And you'll notice here too, look, did you see that? This little button in the right corner, it says pro. So for Canva, that's what I'm logged into right now. There's a free version um, and then there's Canva Pro, which means that's a paid version and it doesn't cost a lot for Canva Pro. Um, I actually, to save money, to cut down on expenses, I pay for a year in advance. And so that makes the price a lot more reasonable. Uh, but still, even if you just do the monthly fee, it's it's also reasonable. It's it's for sure less than $15 a month. I can't remember the exact price. But um, anyhow, so you see here the ones that say pro, that's what would come in your pro version. And like the one right here that doesn't say pro, so it, it's a free version. So the, this one says free. This one doesn't say anything, so I wonder if it's free or pro. Um, but anyhow, you get the idea. All right. So my son is actually on a trip right now. Uh, he's in Roatan and he's been sending me some photos. So I thought, huh, maybe I'll create a little book for him of the photos that he's sending me. Now, um, you can see there's lots of travel options here, but I think I'm going to go with, I saw, oh, let's try this. And um, I clicked on this one. It's called <clears throat> black and white minimalist travel photo books and click on this and I want to apply all 22 pages. Okay. So if you just see at the bottom here, this shows all the pages they just loaded. So if you kind of go through each of these pages, you can kind of put in your own photos. And if there's something in here you don't want, then you can just, there's a, a little circle with three dots. You can just delete it. So let's just kind of go through. So I think I'll just start at the front here and I can change this title page. So you can just edit this. Okay, and I'll put row 10. Um, and Let's see here. Uh, my son graduated from St. Mary's University not too long ago. And of course he graduated during when COVID was pretty heavy. And um, one of the things they were supposed to do it as a, for a class project was go to Roatan. But um, he wasn't able to go while he was still in college and he's already since graduated. But uh, finally the college is, is going to this trip and um, 
they let him attend with their current students. So actually we'll just put, I'll just put 20, 21. Okay. And then you can just change out some of these photos or, you know, you can leave these. I'm going to go to the next one. Um, let's see here. So if I were to just do, I highlighted this and I can delete it. Um, if I go to my uploads, I uploaded some photos. So maybe if I put this photo, um, he sent me, this is a mama dolphin with her two week old baby. So maybe if I put that here and then just change it. Um, oopsie. And then put um, mama dolphin with two week old baby. And then I can even make this bigger. So, cause it's kind of small. Okay, and then I can make it come out like this. Then I could bold it too. So there you go, That's that can be one of our pictures there. And this next picture here, um, we can maybe make it, we can just delete that. Um, he went to a museum to see a, check out a turtle. So we can do this. And I can get um, even more creative, like with the background here, it's how it's white. We can probably put it a different color. Maybe make it, um, let's try this. Mm, or maybe this color. Mm. I could do yellow. And just put... I don't know. I think he said it was a trip to the museum. I can go in here and edit these later. So. Okay. Um, here we can delete these. Actually, I'm just going to delete this whole image altogether. So you see how you can delete it? Um, Probably just delete this one too. And this one. This one. Okay, so let me delete this photo here. He actually sent me a photo of like a, let's see, where did it go? Hmm, it's not here. I thought I uploaded it. Well, we can just put this photo here. So let's just delete, just delete that. And then I'll have to just get some input from him on what he wants me to write here for this caption, for this photo. Then you can just put the background or maybe this color, maybe that color. Um, and then you just can, you can just kind of keep going and editing and adding your own. I kind of like the ones that have words on them. So you can delete the picture. Um, here's a photo of him today. It's hard to see it in this in this picture. Let's see if I can make it bigger. There he is balancing on the water there. Um, and here is a um, actually, let's see here if we go here, delete that picture. Here's a real pretty photo we can add in. Maybe we make the background. Mm -hmm. I'll just leave it there. So you get the idea of what you can do with these um, photo books. And I wonder, I wanted to see what the last page looks like because sometimes they, I know in presentations, they have cool stuff on their last page. So this was, this would be their last page and you can just edit it with your own photos. Um, of course, you can always 
add another page and put whatever you want on your page. You can also duplicate a page. So if you liked this one and you wanted to duplicate it, but maybe make it a different picture, you can do that as well. All right, and when you're done, um, like this already labeled itself as Roatan, but you can maybe put the date. And then what you could do is right here it says, okay, let me see here. You can download this photo book. And then I'm not going to download it since obviously I'm not going to keep all these pictures in here. And he's still gone, so I'll probably add more as he sends me more. Uh, but then I'll, I would download this and then I can give this to him, you know, as a di his digital photo book when he comes back of, of his trip. Um, it looks here like you could print. Let's see what this is. I'm just curious. So if you print the photo book, um, you can select if you want to hardcover, soft cover, the type of finish you want on the photos or the pages. It looks like one copy would cost $20. That's not bad for a photo book. 20 bucks for a gift for somebody. So if you are a business owner and maybe you wanted to, maybe you, you wanted to recognize one of your clients for something that they're doing, um, you can, you know, do this. You know, the gift amount for a, a client gift is 25 bucks. So that fits perfectly in the budget. Um, so anyhow, that, that's something to think to consider. Well, let's see what this page. Scissors. Oh, I see. You go through this process and it takes you through four steps to print the book or to have it printed and I'm sure shipped. So anyhow, that is photo books within Canva. I am going to stop sharing my screen. All right. So if you're interested in getting Canva, um, I'm, I'll include the link in the comments. And if you're interested in having me do a graphic for you, um, I am here, going to be here Monday through Friday from 8.30 p.m. to 8.45 p.m. CST. Uh, let me know if you're interested. I'll put a link in the comment, comments so we can connect and I can do a digital graphic for you of, of whatever you got going on in that time frame. Um, so let me know if you have any questions. Like I said, I'll put a link in the comments. And if you want to sign up for Canva. Um, like I said, it's my affiliate link. So I would get some type of commission for that. So I just want to say thank you. And let me know if you have any, share any comments, questions, or anything like that about, about anything that we're doing. All right. Take care.